lot of things that are difficult about synchronized swimming from um, just you have to be very diverse, you have to be strong, but you have to be flexible, you have to be able to think quickly. But I think that the one thing that makes synchronized swimming really unique is the fact that we can't breathe. We, in a routine, hold our breath for about 30 to 45 seconds at a time and then come up and then go back down. The members of Ohio State's synchronized swim team are dedicated athletes. They are in the pool for several hours each day, perfecting their routines for the season, which begins on Saturday. We counted every movement, but when, like, after months or so, it just automatically goes with music, so I don't even think about counts or movements. It just, like, happened. <laughs> The team has a winning history with 28 U.S. Collegiate National Championships and is under the direction of a new head coach. It's really difficult as the only third time head coach in the history of the program because I can tell you even having been here, having been here for so long, I literally feel the weight of the target on my back. We are the team in the country that has the target on its back from every other team. So to be aware of that, to you know, not focus on it, but to constantly realize that a target's harder to hit if it's always moving. So we want to keep moving every day to make sure that we're you know, staying ahead of what we need to do. Coach Holly Vargo Brown is a longtime Buckeye with more than 25 years of experience with this program. Holly is very systematic and she really has everything planned out and has very high expectations for us to meet each of these little goals that she puts out, which I think is a really great thing and um, I think we're getting a lot better because of that. Vargo Brown says her swimmers are focused and working towards their goal of winning the team event at Collegiate Nationals this year. They really believe in the power of one heart, one beat, one team. They really have bought into that and that's uh, also part of our philosophy is that there, we're 24 athletes, but we're one team. And I think when you can get a group of people to, to really buy into that concept, I think good things start to happen. So that's what we're hopeful. 